Happy Thanksgiving to everybody. Welcome, welcome, folks, to see Fernal Channel. We're about to journey into the unknown. I did like three spontaneous hunting expeditions in Alaska on the 19th, and I'm going to show you what I got. When I was doing it, I didn't think I got a lot until I started looking at it. And oh my God, come on, check it out. This is a strange time we live in, folks. Hear those fireworks going off? You know why? I get 10,000 subscribers. I cannot believe I get 10,000 subscribers. And it's all to you guys supporting and sharing, liking and returning. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Celebration on this side. I don't know if it pays me anything for 10,000 subs, but um, you know, monetizing's a joke. Don't do it. Don't waste your time. Anyways, here we go. So celebrations on 10,000 subs. Hey. What's up, doc? Seriously. <laughs> Seriously, what's up? So here I am faking photoshopping for a year and a half right and showing you stuff like this that i could just see it oh it's all orbs right all lens flares i don't think so wake up what's up doc that's right what's up you know the rabbit's got it right what's up so happy thanksgiving everybody those who are in america those that are not happy thanksgiving because you're still alive and those that don't believe in jesus happy thanksgiving because you're going to get saved on this channel jesus is going to meet you one way or the other that's right. So what we've got here is, I believe on the bottom of the horizon, this is filtered, on the bottom of the horizon there, you're going to see that red planet. I think that's a moon, or one of uh, that's one of uh, Nibiru's moons, I believe. But uh, on the upper one, I tell you, I think there's sun simulators that are like satellite, part of the satellite system that we're seeing reflections of. That's my honest opinion. But the one on the bottom, you'll see it, it'll come out clear. Um, I know that's got to be a planet or a moon. There it is right there. You see it on the bottom there. But I just darkened it up a little bit to see if we could see it better. And you, you actually see them a little bit better. But you see the round objects? Those are not all lens flares. Those are some satellite stuff going on. That's part of the, um, maybe that whole Atlantis system they got going on a space station or whatever they're going to call it. But anyways, <clears throat> it's what it is, guys. So I just wanted to show it to you. I want to say this one thing to you people out there, you folks. I've been doing this for a year and a half. Okay. And I've showed you probably over 7,000 captures that I caught myself. And probably over 3,000 that Ken caught. We're not doing this to entertain you, but I make it into entertainment so it's more, you know, palatable. It's not so freaky. Look at that. I mean, look at, I'm catching rainbows, double rainbows. I'm catching stuff that's just weird. Now, that's like a normal rainbow. But, um, there's stuff going on in the skies. All you got to do is look up, check it out, take a picture, send it to me. I'll put it up here. Because, you know, everybody wants to show you one big planet. You got to learn to read the whole sky, you know? That's the, that's the deal. And so, when I show you stuff... It's not like other channels. They're out there going on uh, disinformation. I don't even give you information. I show you information. I show you what I see. That right there? Are you seeing that blue? Oh, yeah. There's nothing going on, right? That's all normal. No, it ain't. I'm just telling you stop. You can see all kinds of stuff going on. Now, here we go. I'm going to pick something new. I'm just doing a spontaneous. And there's stuff in here. Look at this. 
got that blue and you got the red on the left, right? That's crazy. Not just a sun rise in Alaska. There's more than that going on. But keep watching. Like my banjo? So I'm going to keep coming up, guys, and I'm going to do videos that nobody's doing. I'm not trying to be like the next Nebaru channel. I'm trying to be the guy that shows you angles that nobody wants to show you, like that. And there's no filter on this, folks. No filter. Now, understand me. I would never say my fellow creators on YouTube, my comrades in this community of Planet X Nibiru, would cheat or use Photoshop. I would never say that. I would uh, respect them to the point where they're doing this on their own dime, really. And some are making some good money, but don't think they're all making great money. That's all a bunch of lies. But uh, I wouldn't say anybody's cheating, but I'm showing you what I'm capturing spontaneous. And you can see the reflections of Nemesis or Nibiru and the red planet. And you can see the iron oxide, the red in the sky. I can see it. So the question is, is some of it being fabricated? Yeah, I believe it is. I also believe there's a lot of hologram or hologram, hollow skies, right? Where they're projecting most skies you can't see because of so many clouds. But look at that. That's awesome. I've never seen that in my life. You know? So that might be boring to some, but like this ring, people go crazy over this ring around the sun. Well, this planet behind the sun simulator, right? <laughs> Now, you would see one of those on a clear sky back in the 90s and 80s, maybe in the 80s and 70s. And it would be a normal phenomenon because of the cold coming in or the weather change. But this is incredible. I mean, I've seen some of them that people are putting up from, like, the Alps that are just incredible, folks. So what I think it is, I think it's an actual huge planet behind a sun simulator. That's my information. Now, if that's disinformation, well, so be it. Maybe I'm ignorant on the subject. Um, I'm not a researcher in that sense of, like, conspiracy or any any level like that. I'm just showing you signs in the skies that I'm finding. So that's pretty much simply what it is. Um, if that freaks you out that I show you the truth of what I'm seeing, whatever. But um, these are not normal skies. Look at the chemtrails, folks. Look at the chemtrails. Now look at this. Just keep watching. And there's some better footage coming up. And this is pretty awesome footage, right? <laughs> I think it's awesome. These guys are not really normal guys. Like, you, you will see this same pattern right here. In five different countries in an hour, you're out there hunting. Now, I put a little color on it. You know why I do that? It brings out different highlights. And you know, guys, since I've been doing this, anybody could tell you that I've always told you when I put a filter on it. The first six months, I didn't put filters or do anything. Then people started asking me for it, so... And this is what I've learned how to do in a year and a half, you know? So I just trip it out. It makes it more interesting. Um, if it offends you, sorry, but it's, you know, it's what the people want. You know, some people just want it straight up. And I do that too, you know, no filters. Like right here, right here no filter. As you see the chemtrails. But what's all, what's all this other stuff floating out here? It, you know, I test the cameras. I looked at other days. I've uh, looked at old footage, and there's no dirt on this camera. This is some weird stuff in the sky. And um, just because you can't explain it don't mean it's dirt or it's a smudge. So I put a little bit of purple on it and stuff, and I'm just doing this as I'm going.
just to bring out certain things and there's no Photoshop or anything. But uh, there is a lot of strange stuff in the skies. And some of you guys might know what it is. I listen to WSO and, you know, I believe there's a lot of uh, deception going on. I believe the stage is set for the great deception. And you got to be looking and preparing yourself towards the uh, eternal life in Jesus Christ, you know? So I got more. I'm going to bring you some more stuff, guys. Same area right here. And you got a ring at nighttime with the full moon. Right now, I just found um, the sun rising at 3 o'clock, 2.30 2, 2 to 3 o'clock in Alaska. So I'll put that film up after I put this one up. This one took me a couple days. I had some narration problems. Um, believe it or not, I started recording this 24 hours ago. So I got my eye on a Black Friday brand new laptop. So it's going to happen, guys. I'm going to have a better computer. But anyways, this is just spontaneous stuff I picked up. Uh, I just cleaned it up a little bit. Like right here, the sun simulator just goes off and stretches. Come on, guys. You know, there's a big spudge right there. Right in the middle there. But look at the... You know, and you got to look at the time and date up on top. Pay attention to that because <clears throat> you'll be amazed at some of the stuff that's going on in the east that I don't even realize I'm catching. You know, like this right here is in the west, but Alaska is weird. Canada is weird right now. The skies are like something from a weird movie, from some sci-fi movie. You know, keep watching, guys. I'm gonna crank this music up and uh, come back in a minute. All right. Thumbs up, comment, and subscribe if you haven't. I'll be right back. Get yourself a coffee. Guys, I feel if I didn't show you some of this weird stuff that I see, I'd be cheating you on my channel. So, because you don't see an actual round planet, which I'll show you one, but you see this, it's like a lot of people might go on their own and go look for this kind of stuff, but it'll, you know, a lot of people don't do any of that. So, when I show them this turn purple, you know, there's a lot of reasons it could turn purple right but look at this i'm gonna back it up so on my channel guys if you don't know and you're new here it's to really just explore the skies and kind of look for the weird the next weird thing like that right there that was the next frame you see how that sun summit just took a dive <laughs> that was i'm telling you one frame to the next you know and i always give you the address in place uh you can go look it up for yourself um in real time if I get the movie up quick enough but if not you know you just have to trust me if you don't well you'll learn to you'll keep seeing the weird stuff I put up and you know it's not fake right there right there on the right on the right of the sun did you see that go back and look at that so it looked like I too it really did with the stripes and all you know So I'm trying, and this video is because it's spontaneous, is what we get, but it's pretty good stuff. But the next video, you gotta watch. <laughs> you gotta watch the next video I'm building right now. It's crazy. So I'm gonna get this out, let the music rip to the end, and uh, happy Thanksgiving to those guys who are giving thanks to their God. I'm giving thanks to Jesus Christ. There's only one God, one living God. He's alive right now, Jesus Christ. He saved me, 1985. I've known him. And, you know, because I, I, I'm relaxed about talking about God and I'm not, like, super reverence, don't mean I'm not, guys. 
means I have a relationship with God. I have a relationship with Jesus. I don't have a religion. I have a relationship. You know, some of you guys say higher power. You know, just say it. If you know Jesus, you know Jesus. Be bold. You know, do not be ashamed of the name of Jesus on the internet or in real life. You know, guys? So, happy Thanksgiving, and I'll see you here, there, or in the air. And God bless, guys. Me and my wife love you. Hey, if you want to donate my channel, you're allowed to. Just go down and find the PayPal button. And we'll take any kind of blessing you want to give us for Christmas. Because I'll be honest with you, a year and a half I've gotten $400 in donations. And I appreciate every penny. But it ain't a place to make money on the internet, you know. <laughs> YouTube is not for me a place to make money on the internet. So God bless, guys. Talk to you later. Well, that's not done. Uh, I decided to have some more footage. Here we go. Bonus round. Keep watching. I'll be back. Now you folks be careful out this. this these, these pictures will mess with your mind. They do mine. A lot of you guys watch way too much of this stuff. You get all freaked out by it. But, you know, caution can cause side effects. Now watch, watch what happens in this uh, clip I got. I didn't remember what I had in it, but this is some strange stuff coming up here, folks. Anyways, uh, just keep watching.
As you can see, signs of the sky, all kinds of crazy signs. Tell me what that is. That looks like debris coming down out of space. It ain't snow. And one looked like it had headlights in it. UFOs. Folks, tell me what that is. That is a saucer. Check it out. See, the stage is set for the great deception and the UFOs and, you know, the Pope and the Vatican. It's all set, guys, so prepare your hearts. Get ready. So here's some random footage I got, and I just, you know, zoomed in some stuff and found some things in it. So you be the judge. Comment, subscribe, thumbs up, and like. Strange times we live in, folks. Well, normally when I see stuff like this, I think it's got to be UFOs or falling stars, but then they zoomed in on it. That's pretty trippy looking. So there you go, guys. There's all kinds of debris in the sky, all kinds of vehicles, spaceships, crafts, you know. And to me, signs in the sky are signs. Anything that's abnormal, you can call a UFO, you can call it whatever. It's just signs in the sky to me. So there yeah. That's what I think. Anyways, keep watching. It gets better, even.
that's about it for now guys thanks for stopping by happy turkey turkey day give thanks for something have gratitude for something there's got to be something in your life that's good right now so today just give god a little bit of thanks thank you jesus for all these subscribers and new subscribers and god bless people talk to you later